Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to XCOM Enemy Unknown. I'm the Marmoset, and we've got, in today, a chrysalid autopsy, where we get to find out what the chrysalid things are made out of. Those are things that ruined us hideously in Operation Flying Tantrum. Also, 13 days till we get a large chunk of cash again, and we actually, you know, maybe buy another satellite. One of the things we picked up in the last set was a load of interesting bits of kit. So the troops will be eager to get out there and even up the body count. That's nice. Um, Captain A, that's it, yeah, that's fine. XCOM Finances, visit the Grey Market. <laughs> We can quite happily sell damaged gear because it's absolutely no use to us. So that's an extra hundred dollars. Twenty-seven sectoid corpses. No idea what we might be looking at with that lot. Doctor Valen's interrogation technique certainly is efficient. You'd never know it by looking Quiet, at her. Please, control that central. woman is an alien's worst nightmare. Any requests? No requests available. Good, good. So. Ideally, I'd like to get some kind of satellite up over France. That'd be really, really good. But we need to expand our satellite capability. So, engineering... Our worst suspicions may have been true after all. They're not just here for abductions. They have something else in mind. Facility. Thermal generator. Lift platform. How much power have we got? 57. Okay, that's pretty good. Can we build... What do we need for a satellite uplink? More engineers. Cash. Increase things, increase that. Each workshop adds five engineers to our staff. Terms of uh, chase and sea bonus. Okay. So there's the foundry. So if we were to put a additional engineering guy in, that would help a fair bit. So there's a bit of power area, satellite area. Okay. So I am probably going to put in what well, let's um upgrade items. Heavy weapons plating. Wow. Heavy weapons platform. Unmanned drone. Nice. Improved pistol. Weapon fragments, five engineers, seventy five gold. That's a fair amount. But Another arc thrower wouldn't be bad. 148. Carapace armor with the engineers for. That's an upgrade to our fighters. Let's start building a satellite. Commander, our current satellite uplink facilities are at full capacity. We should build additional uplinks as soon as possible to allow for new satellite deployments. Yeah, I'm aware of that, but the sooner I get a satellite being built, <laughs> the better. So now I've got 78, 81 credits. Um, another arc throw wouldn't be bad. Something like a forward and foundry. Shiv unit. But I think I will have a look. I will probably stick that extra workshop in, because I desperately need the engineers to be able to build... Um, more satellites for the satellite uplink network. So I think that's everything we need there. Don't have any research ready. Let's head back to mission control and scan for activity. Oh, that's actually, no, before we do that, we should Command, the barracks. We've suffered a number of casualties and haven't found suitable replacements yet. We need to start hiring additional soldiers through the barracks. Oh, well, we don't have any cash, and I'm actually pretty sure that we haven't, um, we don't have any losses. We've got gravely wounded for quite a while. All my uh, lieutenants are badly hurt, but Major Zero. New training, no profile, no matures on that one, so what's that? Partial cover counts as full. Well, that's nice. It can be up, arm is up, not in the defense, yes, because I haven't actually equipped them with any decent kit yet. Pixie, you get, was it extra medicals or extra smoke grenade? I would like more medicine, please. Confirm. Heavy. Yep. Yeah. Yep, smoke grenade. Yep. Yeah. That's all, all the gear. Um, let's go. You guys are all quite badly injured. So let's... So you've got nothing in your extra slots. 
Yes, you should have a scope. You should have the med kit. Frag grenade. Heavies get extra defense or not? Okay. Support. Heavy, heavy. Total rookie. <laughs> right, I'm going to start putting a push in. I've always bring sure I bring the lowest ranked squaddy I've got who's fit out so that my rotation gets sorted out. So, have an arc thrower. And I think we're pretty good. So, we're probably bringing out top three and then swapping out uh, Alex for Tina on our next mission. Let's go and find out what that mission is going to be. Activity Scan 4. Chrysalid Autopsy Report. Assign new research. Chitin plating available for manufacture. Quite as beautiful and quite as deadly. Gestation, uh, embryos, really unpleasant things. Chitin plating. Accept. Precision laders. These are nice and fast actually because we've got the extra bits and pieces. Ooh. Nice, our own fighter craft. Um, let's get precision lasers. That might be a new sniper rifle. In the interim, engineering, build by items. What was it? Shit in plating. What is that? See, I know laser rifles and laser pistols. I know what those are. They're weapons. I know that's an auxiliary bit of kit. Alright, so that's armour. Those are items. Right, okay, fair enough. So, chitin plating is a add-on or an extra bit. Whereas Carapaz armour is actually armour. So I've got plenty of alloys, but I definitely need the engineers, and I want this kind of stuff. So, building that extra workshop with the remains of our cash is probably going to be the best. Which is going to be due, and then the cancer report will come in, and then we should be able to get started and get kicked in. Oh, view abduction sites. Commander. We have multiple reports of new abductions in progress. The locations okay. are marked on the hologlobe. The reward for clearing out in Argentina, who has no current panic, is cash. Hong Kong would give me four engineers. No current panic. South Africa would give me a new assault captain. They have a little bit of panic. But I want engineers. <laughs> because I'm struggling with various bits and pieces. Well, a couple times I'm going to get that foundry up and running. And that's going to give me the engineers I need to get this new satellite uplink. Um, would I like a new recruit? Yes. The panics. I don't want the cash. Mm, engineers would be really, really nice. Do I go to Johannesburg or Hong Kong? The game is telling me this is going to be more difficult. And I don't have my prestige team with me. So I am going to hope that that tick up on the panic on Johannesburg is going to be a learning experience, but not how far much more than two it goes. So we're off to Hong Kong to get myself some engineers as a reward. So as I was saying, I was going to drop Graham and add in Tina, who I believe is carrying in her loadout, the arc thrower. Would be nice if you could see the loadout and some of the bits and pieces here. Um, I suspect you could see it. She got the actually check the gear that they're carrying. Oh, it does say arc through a frag grenade scope med kit frag grenade. Yep. Okay. Um, can't do that one yet. So let's launch this mission. We've got some alien abductions in Hong Kong to deal with. It's quite a flight this one. Strike one. Prepare for landing. Yes, we will. Opposition. <laughs> Operation Crystal Bread. It's like crystal meth, We've but you can spread jam on it. Indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Clear civilians, sweep and kill. Okay. Touchdown. Obligatory people running off the thing. That's quite a cool shot, huh? Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage. So we have up and down terrain. We appear to have deployed on a rooftop. Pretty nice flying. Let's see if we can find anything 
worth shooting. Well, we've got gooey people. I don't quite know what they were doing up here. Pigeons! There are pigeons. Get over there. See what you can see. Nothing. That's fine. Hunk it down. Hey, Pixie. Get in that Enemy corner. in sight. Thin men. Looks like that should provide an amount of cover. That's a dash. Are you exposed? No, you're hunkering down, but that's telling you that that is exposed. Yep. And shoot. Damn, missed the target. Yes, I noticed. Alright, I've already captured a thin man, so I don't necessarily need to have another one. You've not got a line of sight, okay. And... That's telling me that's going to be risky, so move up to here. Missing doesn't help, Dara. Missing doesn't help, particularly when they can shoot back at me. They're moving around the side. Ah! Yes, yeah, that's my captain and that's my major. That's my senior officer getting shot. It's a crappy positioning. Oh, I just caught out. Ouch, ouch, and ouch. Yeah, well, I'm going to get rid of these guys pretty soon next turn. Um... 80% of a chance to hit. Would you be so kind? Thank you. What's your chance? 56? Yeah. Leave me some space. Yay, nothing but plague. Good. Right. Now, I'm pretty sure there's not going to be anyone else causing me too much problems that way around. Alright, I don't really want to get up onto there. Because I can't dash far enough. Can you get up in the position where you can actually see something? Yes, you can get up onto here. That provides some nice juicy overwatch for the next turn. And give us some nice visuals now. Okay. Move up to here. Avoid the sticky corpse. So, how much damage did you take? Three, two. All right, so they're going to be wounded, but not too bad. Tuck into that nice corner there. And Overwatch. This alien activity. No audio cues. Okay. Let's have you scoot over to here. Give me an overwatch, and let's bring Zero up there, where he should have, on his next turn, a really juicy amount of visual range and accuracy. Okay, so we've got our two guys up on the roof to give us cover. Let's see what we can find as we move up. Let's swing the camera around. Okay. Let's dash. I really like to do it when, when these guys are still on up and it's dashed to full cover. Nothing. Let's uh, shuffle people along. Put up alongside that box crate. You come to here. Go into Overwatch. Show me that Overwatch with a rock launcher. That might be a tad excessive if you fire when I not really want you to. Okay, there's someone up over there. What? Well, you are pleasantly creepy. I'd be surprised if Zero has actually got a line of sight on some of those. Yep, yeah, I know, they're over there. He doesn't, but give me an overwatch. So. You, my dear. Tina. How far forward can you get? 
without getting yourself hideously caught out. I don't want you over that side, it's just a bit too risky. Right, so they were scuttling up all the way over there. That's really unhelpful. Um, no visual, unhelpful. To here. No more. <laughs> To hope we don't, nothing appears from over here, it doesn't look like we've got much over this way. Let me overwatch again. You dash up so you're in a better position. Nice shot landing as well. Good work. Yeah, that was the bloke just exploding. You're a little scuttlebug, aren't you? Block, if you wouldn't be so kind as just stand your ground for a little bit. Interesting, so I know he is somewhere in here and potentially might be looking at going up there, so let's leave you two in Overwatch mode and bring you up to there and also go into Overwatch. So if he does try to come up with the ladder, he will have an unpleasant reward for his efforts. Can I get you any more useful? No, go there. And also go into Overwatch. Yep, he did come up the ladder. And Zero is probably going to finish him off. I think there's only four here. So this might be... Keep score. <laughs> Alright, so that arm oh, more out here. Or at least it's going to wait for the animation to finish. Yeah, okay, so there are more out here. So you got yourself another shining kill. Uh, probably should have waited on that one. So other aliens might be up over that way. I don't want to run either of you two through the GAC. So. Give me a dash up there and I've got so a visual. see. Ah, bingo, there we go. There's a remaining two. Oh, hold a thin man with us for this one. No one's got line of sight, unfortunately. Yeah, yeah, we heard and saw him. Yeah, we did. We saw him. The animation cutscene told us. Come up to over here. Right, okay. I don't like the open ground we've got over here. But I'm not immediately happy that we can get much better, so flip around the other side, do the overwatch. You already on overwatch, so ready. Let's see if the enemy are dumb enough to having retreated to a better position to move. Nope, they're not. Right. I'm gonna leave you where you are, because I'm pretty sure that you've got half a different range of fire. I suspect you might need to get you some visuals. So creep you up over here. You're stuck behind a portal move for now, up here. You cut because I don't think I can immediately get an easy way of getting you forward. So you can get a shot on, but uh, that corner looks like it might be better than nothing. Oh, you have a shot. Who have you spotted? Him. Have I put you in Overwatch already? Yeah, I did. Fine. Um, yeah, take that shot and see what you can get. Good. Nicely done. And permission. What's making that noise? The aliens. Who else would it be? I don't quite know who you're expecting to be out here. I mean, you're an alien group dedicated to shooting aliens. That said, given the other weird shit you guys have come across, not that entire surprise you approach, but what type of alien are we going to actually be experiencing this time? We'd love to get close enough to get another interrogation, but I think we're probably going to get these guys killed at range. Unless one of them is happy enough to actually bump his, uh, bump uglies all the way up with us. Get over here. I suspect we're not going to get lucky enough and get anyone close enough. Oh, that's going to sting. 
Can you please stop getting shot in the head? Can you return the guy's, um... Can you heal your own wound? Yes. Magic spray makes the plasma burns better. Now he's already used his overwatch. So that means I can now uh, shoot him. <laughs> Move around primarily. Let's get his cover damaged. Out of ammo, it's the target. You've not got a shot. I see you're in a really good position to try and sneak up on the guy. But you don't have a stunner. She does. And there is no way you're going to be able to get over all that cover without getting spotted. No cover, no cover, no cover. Can dash down to there. There's a better spot. It's a hell of a jump and drop. That was lucky. Given you're flanked. You've got a shot from there. Fine, we'll sit and wait for a little bit. Pretty sure that I've got several people with shots on this guy, so if this doesn't go well, then I should be able to just shoot him. That's the square next to him, yep. Yeah. Stun, 70% chance. Archon. Looks like you're coming home with us. Nice. Excellent work. All objectives complete. Nice. Don't have a uh, request to bring in a thin man. <laughs> yeah, I imagine he probably does smell, given the way he explodes the crappy produce. I think that pretty much that was a very successful mission. A couple hits here and there. A couple of people took a, um, got shot um, when the early guys flanked me quite nicely. But we do have another captive. That means we've got some weapons intact. And we've got some more engineers. Let's just wonder how badly the threat increased in Johannesburg. Johannesburg? Johannesburg? Johannesburg. A little alien symbol on the side of our craft. So we've got a promotion. Oh, you're doing so well, Zero. Wounded for seven days. Down for five. Promoted. To a corporal. Everyone else is good. We've got a thin man captive weapon fragment and a light plasma rifle. Panic has increased in Africa and South Africa, but we got those Remember, engineers that I want. We will be watching. Expanded engineers, so we should have a nice big pile of engineers in a bit. Let's just double check the situation room. So the panic in South Africa went up quite a bit, so it did go up. So looks like we will be trying to invest the best we can in. Seeing what we can do about making sure that Africa doesn't desert us too badly. I suspect there's a pretty good chance we are going to lose at least one African country. Um, because I know my next satellite is probably going to go up over France. But in the interim, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I've been the Marmoset. This has been XCOM Enemy Unknown. And that was yet another mission. Um, I forgot the mission title. I was going to try and uh, intro and swag in that. But anyway, if you like me trying to do intro swags and forgetting what I was talking about, please remember to like and subscribe.